Sergeant Wright, and it was actually a surveillance video camera over at West Shore Mall Plaza that caught this all on tape. It actually zooms into the officer and the lights on his car because of the motion. It happened in the early morning hours, so the video was dark. Of February 1st, the officer fired a month later after his DNA found on her underwear. This investigation is a shock and disappointment to all of us at TPD. The video is grainy, hard to see details, but you can clearly spot flashing police car lights. It was a shock to us, uh, something that's, you know, it's hard to believe. Tonight, former Tampa police officer Adam York facing sexual battery charges after detectives say he pulled over a woman for speeding while off duty in the parking lot at West Shore Plaza, then assaulted her. It was uh, after one of our events, so we had multiple agencies in town helping us. Uh, so it was hard for us to determine initially exactly what agency was involved. Chief Eric Ward says the sex battery happened February 1st, Gasparilla weekend. That Officer York was on his way into work at District 3. A police report reads York demanded the woman pull down her pants and underwear, then battered her. That a lab found his touch DNA on her underwear. <laughs> No one answered the door at the former officer's Clearwater home, and Chief Ward says York told them the battery never happened. On February 8th, Adam York was interviewed and denied all allegations.